the digging of a lake and the building of a ramp. Another topic. Behold, thou comest and fillest me with thine office. I will cause thee to know how matters stand with thee, when thou sayest I am the scribe that issue th commands to the army. There is given thee a lake to dig. Thou comest to me to inquire concerning the rations for the soldiers, and sayest reckon it out. Thou desertest thine office, and the task of teaching thee to perform it falleth on my shoulders. Come, that I may tell thee more than thou hast said five I cause thee to be abashed. When I disclose to thee a command of thy Lord, thee, who art his royal scribe, when thou art led beneath the window six in respect of any goodly work, thee in the mountains are disgorging great monuments for Horus, the lord of the two lands. For see, thou art the clever scribe who is at the head of the troops. A ramp is to be constructed, 730 cubits one long, 55 cubits wide containing 120 compartments, and filled with reeds and beams, 60 cubits high, at its summit, 30 cubits in the middle, with a, of 15 cubits, and its, cubits, the quantity of bricks needed for it is asked of the generals, and the scribes are all collected together, without one of them knowing anything. They all put their trust in thee and say thou art a clever scribe, my friend. Decide for us quickly. Behold, thy name is famous, let one be found in this place to magnify the other thirty. Do not let it be said of thee that there is aught thou dost not know. Answer us, how many bricks are needed for it? See, its measurements, are before thee. Each one of its compartments is of thirty cubits and is seven cubits broad.